Good morning. It is Sunday, January 2nd, and it's like 17 degrees out, which is colder than I care for. But I got up and got ready anyways, and I'm heading to church. Jesus walked up to somebody or God addressed somebody's personality. I don't see it. Right? I mean, there are some people with crazy personalities and different things and things. You never once see Jesus pulling somebody aside and being like, dude, take it down a notch. I <laughs> think <laughs> you just don't, you know, like, you know, Matthew, knock it off, call the numbers. Okay, we're heading up. Like, we don't need that. Like, you never, you just, you don't see God addressing those things. God addresses the condition of a person's heart, right? The sons of thunder, they were so boisterous, and Adam, Jesus was like, I love you guys, let me give you a nickname. <laughs> because they are who God made them to be. Right. And just got out of church. Uh, we had a message on, um, uh, I guess, using Peter as an example of just um, uh, not... Not needing to feel like, oh, I wish I was more like that person, or I wish I was more like them, you know. God has made your personality what it is intentionally. God uses that. Uh, he may want your heart towards him to be softer. Um, you know, he does not want a hard heart. But softening your heart doesn't, by any means, have to change your personality and who you are. Um... You know, that can still shine through with a softer heart. Um, and I hung out and talked to folks for a while afterwards. And uh, now I'm back out in the car in the cold and I'm going to head to Gingham's. Meet Mom and Mike for uh, lunch. It's a nice meal with family. And Mom reminded me, I have like warmer jackets. I just haven't thought about it this year because I haven't needed it. And I was like, oh yeah, I should probably... Pull one of those out, because it's cold now all of a sudden. Because <laughs> it's too cold. I don't like the cold. I used to live in Florida. I miss it. <laughs> so once I was home, I um, recorded a few episodes of Pokemon. I'm enjoying it. It's fun. So while it's easy to record, I record. I've also gotten the first couple of them scheduled, so... Should be coming out here in the first week of the year. Um, and I was noticing on the second and third one that I was recording, sort of a raspy kind of feeling right in my chest. I'm getting some sort of congestion, so I took some medicine for that. And I laid down for a bit. Like, uh, so not feeling the greatest. Oh well. Not great. And I'm not sick, but I'm not well. Just got a bit congestion in my chest. Um, enough to be concerning. And I, it, I only really noticed it because I recorded um, some Pokemon earlier. And it was while talking for a long period of time that I started to be able to kind of notice it. So I took some medicine from that and hopefully Clears it up before it becomes anything. Um, since I caught it at that point. I'm just thinking, man, go back to work tomorrow and talk all day. So hopefully it's fine. Um, I'm not sure, given Nick, if we'd be able to play tomorrow anyways, but I just want to hold until my buddies eh, cancel tomorrow. That way I don't have to worry about it. I'll just be like, you know what? I'm gonna take take the time off. I don't know if it's just my body, if if maybe a little time out in the cold is enough that it's freaking out, or if it's my brain and it's just like, how dare you take me out into the cold? I'm gonna make you feel like crud. And again, that's not that bad. Um, since I've now not been talking for a while, I I, I can't really tell if it's still there, if medicine's cleared it up, but. 
I imagine that even if the medicine cleared it up, it's only temporary. I don't know. I'm going to try and be careful with it. Not let it turn into something if I can avoid it. <laughs> I decided to finish off such a cold day with a cup of hot chocolate. Try and warm up before heading to bed. It's quite a cold day. Not a fan of it. Feeling alright at this point. Hopefully that continues. But uh, otherwise, work week resumes. So I'm going to get to bed and get ready for it. Thank you for joining me and joining me as my journey continues.